So what is it about the left that allows them to get away with this double standard? And how come we on the right do not put a stop to it? It seemed like the police were asked to stand down in these situations out there in uh, uh, Seattle and other far west, you know, places. You well, you're what? asking the you're asking the brilliant question, which is, who is behind it, and what is their target goal? In Seattle, it came out that the mayor ordered the police chief to stand down. It came out in Berkeley that the Berkeley mayor ordered the police to stand down, and the police unions go crazy. You're, you're telling us not to do our job. We see people raping. We see people murdering. We see people rioting. And you want us to just go to the corner and do nothing? And they're told, yes, it'll be better if you do that. Why? Because the politicians that have been elected are supported by people with gobs of money pushing a socialist left-wing agenda. And it's the free stuff movement. Go to California, man. The oh, taxes man. are through the roof. The law enforcement is standing down. ICE is locked out. And what's happening is you've got homeless everywhere and endless new social programs being enacted and no law enforcement allowed to enact uh, security as per their sworn duty. I, I'm horrified by it. I truly am. And I hope, I hope what happened two years ago that caused Donald Trump to be elected, which was the great silent majority rose up and said, to hell with the polls, I don't believe CNN, I'm gonna vote my heart, right? Yeah. It's gonna happen on local basis from coast to coast. Yeah, and so eventually, I think there's enough Americans that are gonna get angry enough saying, hey, you can't come and take my stuff and you can't tax me into the poorhouse and I am gonna vote you out of office. And when enough people feel that way, you'll see a change.